the Wanton Vicious. Wanton. You get to the street when you go to uh, to Royal Studios, and th there's this big sign, and it kind of gives you the the chills in the beginning. I mean, you read these names who worked there and recorded there. And you're like, all right, this is going to be quite impressive. When Matt called me, I was like, a blues band from Lebanon, Le Lebanon, Tennessee, <laughs> Lebanon, Texas. He's like, no, Beirut. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> He had all sorts of gadget and amp and synthesizer and keyboard and gear and guitar that we could ever dream of. We're like, okay, this stuff is serious. And then he shows you the amps, the modern ones and the old ones, and the really older ones that would look like a fucking wooden box, literally. I wouldn't ever imagine to be in a studio where all these people recorded. Keith Richards recorded I mean, here, the Beatles the recorded here. Yeah. Let's I see. was in here fucking rocking out. <laughs> the last I think we should keep on. it fresh, man. It's, but I, I, have one th I fucked up in one little place. It's oh, better, sorry, man. We can fix you too, man. <laughs> we'll make it too perfect, man, and it won't happen no this old. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm really protective of my idea of the song. But one of the first things I learned from Boo was musical humility. I learned that I have to be open to other people's ideas and, and, and be ready to experiment and test things. And that there are no rules in music. How's that for some audio? Well, you're driving me crazy. What is the letter of the river? The studio has been here since 1957 and it's most famous for recording Al Green, Robert Plant, and um, Buddy Guy, John Mayer. So we're going to add the bishops to a very long list of musicians of esteemed astute and get it done. Yeah. 